Appalachian Wireless offers the easy way to pay with Forward Pay. And now it's even easier with unlimited talk text with three gigs for just $44.99. No credit check, no contract, no problem. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Here at Belfry High School today, former Pike County Sheriff Charles Fuzzy Kazee was remembered for his long record of service to his community, his kindness, and his willingness to shake hands with everyone that he met. Charles Edward Fuzzy Kazee died two days before Christmas at Pikeville Medical Center. Today, nearly 200 people, friends, local officials, and fellow police officers bid him farewell. Although I moved many miles away, we never forgot our friendship. Thank you, Fuzzy, for helping me achieve my lifelong dream of being a police officer. I know I made you proud. Kazee served on and off as Pike County Sheriff between 1962 and 2014 when he lost his final re-election bid to current Sheriff Rodney Scott. When he left office, he was Kentucky's longest-serving sheriff. Former Governor Paul Patton, who spoke at today's funeral service, spoke of how Kazee achieved legend status across the Commonwealth for his decades of service that began with a stint in the U.S. Army. He added, however, that that legend was eclipsed by Fuzzy's reputation for compassion and kindness. It was amazing how well Fuzzy was known around the state, not just with the sheriffs, but with any other public officials, because if there ever was a public official in Kentucky that demonstrated how to, how to show that you care for people. He was fuzzy to Z, and he was well known for it, and he was well liked for it. State Senator Ray Jones said he personally, along with countless others, experienced Fuzzy's compassion in the wake of the death of a loved one. When my grandfather passed away, Fuzzy was there and put his arm around me in the cover. And there are so many families in eastern Kentucky, thousands of families he has touched by walking in and paying his condolences and showing his respect. And I hope to be able to do that here today to the family because I truly love us. A host of deputies from the Pike County Sheriff's Office attended today's funeral service. Following the conclusion of the services, those deputies escorted Kazee's funeral procession south along US-119 en route to Fuzzy's final resting place at Annie E. Young Cemetery at Shelbyana. Fuzzy was 89. Reporting in Belfry for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.